Hello, everyone. Welcome back to JSA TV and JSA Podcast. We are live here at DCD Virginia in beautiful Leesburg. I, we are covering the latest stories, trends, and innovations in the digital infrastructure industry today. I'm Candace Sipos with JSA, and I am joined today by Dave Sterles from Hitachi Energy. Welcome, Dave. Thanks, Candace. Good to be here. Yeah, we're so happy to, to chat with you. You actually, I think, just kind of ran over here from the panel that you just got off of. Yeah, so an thank exciting, you. exciting day. Yeah, where yeah, we had a panel on the future of on-site generation and data centers, which is becoming more and more important, of course. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So if you could just, for anybody who may not have been able to make the panel or might not actually be here today, kind of watching, tuning in remotely, could you give us an, uh, a quick overview or, you know, maybe one top takeaway from the panel? Well, I, I think a couple things are changing in, in on-site power. For, for years, we had dependent on diesels for good reason. Energy density is there, they're reliable, they work. Now we're, we're looking more at sustainable power. We're also looking at not over provisioning. So mm -hmm. those two things together make for a really interesting landscape of, of the, you know, what we're gonna use. Mm -hmm. And then the why is changing because data center loads are changing and projected to change significantly with the advent of AI and, and more dependence on machine learning. Okay, excellent. We're definitely going to get into AI here in a minute, so we're excited for that. Um, so there's so much talk about the demands for power. We keep hearing about that, especially here in Virginia, right? It's such a, a critical challenge right now. And ideally, sustainable power, really. Exactly. So that's, exactly. the, that's the key. So what is the, the number one change, in your opinion, that the industry needs to make in order to keep up with demand sustainably? Yeah, I, I, I think what's changing is, first of all, we, we need to understand a couple things. We need to be a partner with the grid rather than, or the energy provider, the utility company, rather than just a consumer. Mm -hmm. So that that's changing significantly. And we also need to be able to, you know, the old adage, you can't manage what you can't measure. We need to understand where our power is coming from. And traditionally, I think our industry gets a little bit of an unfair black eye because mm -hmm. of, uh, of power, you know, bulk power usage. But we're also the first ones that have put in the PPAs and built the solar plants mm -hmm. and things to help help offset our, our, our carbon, offset our, uh, you know, dependence on, on coal or whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So yeah. I think that the, uh, that is really what is, what is changing. Yeah. Interesting partner to the grid. I like that. Um, and so we promised we would talk a little bit about AI, which is of course another one of the key topics. You can't, you can't have a conference like this anymore without getting into AI. So um, it's part of nearly every conversation it feels like these days. So how do you think the industry will really be talking about this next year? And like, where is the conversation headed? Yeah, I think from what we've seen so far, and, and again, to your point, it, we're very, very early. It's not at industrial scale. Um, it, it looks like the, the low profile is changing significantly. So we're going from basically a flat load to something that's going to be much more variable. And with that, all of a sudden, to what I talked about before, the, the reliance on the grid has, needs to be more of a partnership because you're going to have to really anticipate these loads and how to, how to really, um, you know, for years, data centers were the ideal customer. They had a flat load, right? Mm. But, and and now with variable loads, that's that's tough for the yeah. grid. It's tough to spin up assets quickly. And will on-site generation take a portion of that? How is that going to work? So I really think that conversations, as we go from pilot sites to production sites, is going to be incredibly important. And to do that sustainably is going to be a real challenge for the industry. And one of the things I like about the industry is we keep getting these new new ideas new changes and new ways to think about it so it's always always interesting but yeah there, we're gonna there's some heavy roll up our sleeves type work coming for sure yeah absolutely well that feels like a good place for us to to wrap things up thank you so much for joining us dave thank you candace pleasure thank, to be here thank you and thank you viewers for watching jsa tv live here from dcd virginia happy networking <laughs>